Well, hello, all my fluid art friends at Stores 50F Designs. Welcome to my Tuesday Night Live. I am going to do something that was inspired very much by Fiona. Last couple of days, she did some puddle pour flowers without the napkin. And I tried one yesterday. <laughs> and Cheryl and Janice know this. I forgot to hit record. But that's okay because I made some other mistakes on the flower. And I'm just going to try to recreate it again. I'm going to add leaves tonight. So let me say hello. First off, I see Cheryl here. Welcome, 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 Cheryl. And let's give it up for my moderator. You guys are awesome. And let me see. I see J sweet Janice here. I see Linda S. and Linda T. Or La Chat, as we call her. Um, I see Evelyn. I see Anna Ferguson. I see Pamela. Nice to see you here, Pamela. And um, I'm looking. Um, hey, I got everybody. Well, there she is. Hello, Shannon. And hello, Justine, because she's probably watching over your shoulder. Another moderator I want to give a give it up for. So, oh, I missed you too, Cheryl. Okay, so first, this is a 14 by 14. I made a board a little bit bigger and covered it in foil and taped it to the uh, to the top of my uh, spinner because it was just hanging off and not being even. So let me put some paint down. And I think Cheryl's got a... Uh, I don't know what's going on um, later, um, but something for Kathleen that she's going to advertise. And I love supporting other artists. Okay. I don't know what she's got going on, but you can go ahead and put the ad in there. I do. Um, oh, hey, Jeff B. And hello, Renee. I'm looking. Okay, let me see if that was enough paint. Yeah, I just got to get it to cover up all the little gaps I didn't fill in. Okay, come on. Run, 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 paint. Run like the wind. Or run for a scump run. Isn't that the line from the movie? <laughs> so I'm talking to my paint like it's Forrest Gump now. Run, paint, run. Okay, I can see I need a little bit more. And of course, I'm doing a back black ground, so right off the bat, I've got to wipe my... And hello, Joy E, I see you here. I got to uh, wipe my gloves off before I pick up my bottle or I end up getting paint all over the outside of my bottle okay let me just give it some more over here that should be enough run Forrest run yep except in this case it's run paint run okay let me see if I can get it over to this edge now Come on. I tested my paint before I put it in the bottle to make sure that my base coat was was enough. And pre-painted my white canvas because I hate how the white shows through on the black. Okay, and of course, wipe the hands again. See who else is here. Oh, okay. And you know who's going on right before her? Massey boys are. They're doing a quadruple uh, paint grenade and a quadruple ring pour. 
Oh, and the other Joy's here. Hello, Joy B. And I, and I know I saw Joy E, too. Yep, lots of Joy tonight. That is so fun. Okay, let me... Because I did shake it right before I poured it, so let me get rid of any air bubbles I may have. Okay, I'm going to start with Carmine Red by Amsterdam. All of my paints are mixed two to one with my Floetrol and Emulsibon pouring medium. And my pouring medium is, the recipe's down in the description. It is 80% Floetrol and 20% Emulsibon. And then that gets mixed, that becomes um, um, the pouring medium. And then the paint gets mixed. Oops, shoot. It's a little off on that one. That's okay. The one that I sent the picture of to Cheryl and Janice was way off. It was like an oval flower. And it was on the same size canvas. But I was on a nice video chat today with my friend Fiona. Um, I mean, we didn't talk all, all about painting, but she gave me a, a helpful hint with my, um, with my painting. Oh, and hello, Tanya. And let's see who, and hello, Kelly. I saw your email and I answered you today, Kelly. Um, I just, Tuesdays, it's hard, it's still a little wonky. It, it's still a little wonky, but oh well. Okay, now this one is the Nathal Red Light, I'm pretty sure. Let me see. No, Red Medium. It's the Nathal Red Medium. And I'm just putting a small dot right here. I probably put too much of the red on, but I did that in the other one too. And I love all the effects I got in it, so I thought, why not do it again? Because I get some really beautiful lacing between the red and the black with this emulsibon. Now, Fiona, the one she did today was three little flowers, but the one she did the other day was one big flower. Yep, they sure are a little bit more realistic. Uh, let me see. Am I missing anybody? I, yeah, okay. I said hello to Tanya. Um, I'm just reading real quick. Um, this one is the age, Azo Orange. Yeah, just Azo Orange. I thought it was the medium, but no, it's, it's just Azo Orange. And I'm just putting another small dot. I didn't want to get the white, the pearl white next to the red because I really don't want pink. And if Lisa was here, she'd be happy I didn't, didn't try to get pink. <laughs> she hates pink. And I knew this was going to be a slow process of getting these dots on here, but the end result looks, will look pretty. I can guarantee you that because I used these colors yesterday. I just wish my camera had not cut out seven minutes into it. And let's see. Uh, oh, hello, Renee. No, it's um, um, it's not the new um, flow troll. The Emulsibon mixes with the flow troll. And um, yeah, I'm going to do gold next, and then I'll do some white on top of that. Uh, and hello, Rochelle. I don't know why YouTube is bad about their notifications. I really don't know. Um, but the flow troll with the Emulsibon, and Fiona totally agrees with me, that it is the closest we can get to her effects 
that she gets with her European products, but we, but it's with American products we get here in the States. She's tested it out. She tested out the glue too, and I don't think she was happy, happy using her glue. So I sent her some school glue, and we'll see how she likes that. Um, but this right here, after many weeks of testing a couple months ago, this is what I came up with and got the closest I could to her. Um, um, yes, it, do, it does. It gives more of that, um, the cells and lacing effect that she gets. And all oh, my flowers going way off. I just looked at the screen. Okay. I try to keep my Tuesday night live to one, one pour. Wait a minute, let me get that around here so I don't reach across and dribble. My bottles don't have bibs on them, so I don't want them to dribble. <laughs> Sorry. Hey, you can tell I'm a grandma if I talk about bibs and dribbling, okay? Uh, there we go. Okay, let's see if anybody else came in. Uh, nope, don't see anybody, any new names. Just want to make sure. Ah, and there is Linda G. Hello, sweet Linda G. How are you, honey? See, I was looking at the screen just as she typed. Although with the lag, I probably said hello to her 30 seconds after she typed. I mean, that, that YouTube lag can be really, really bad. I saw how bad it was on um, Sarah Max auction over the weekend. It was, uh, it was a little bad on Brian's auction, too. They both had gorgeous pieces. If I have enough time, I'm going to show the two that I got, that I bought at Brian's auction. Okay. Yep, Linda's in the house. Yep. Happy, happy, joy, joy, Linda, Linda, Linda. <laughs> okay, let me, oh, that was, um, that was, um, turquoise blue that I just put on there. The gold was the deco art, um, Americana decor, um, um, 24 karat gold. And this is, this is the one that says medium. It's the Azo Yellow Medium by Amsterdam. And I'm actually going to try on the outside in a couple places. I'm going to try those leaves and see how they do. Don't know what they're going to do, but... It's just to fill in the corners a little bit because everything turns out good. I may not have to spin it. Okay, there is the yellow. Quick, we need to find more joy. We found a lot of joy. I'm in my happy place, so this is my joy. Okay, now I'm just going to do another round. And I'm probably going to get pink now from this. This is why Fiona and a couple other artists fast forward through this part because this can be the most boring thing to watch. Me slowly put little drips of paint on each of the petals. Okay, white, white, white. I am gonna, I am gonna lock it in with some gold. Yep, exactly, Evelyn. Never enough joy. Okay. Right. Come on. Don't need you dribbling. I got that little tail. 
coming out of the bottle. Come on, there we go. Be nice, bottle. Don't give me fit. My flop, my petals are still going a little wonky. They're they're just going out of shape, but I'm pretty sure it'll look pretty. Uh, okay, there we go. Oh yes, yes, you are in your happy place, huh? I I love this community. I really do. Um. Okay, I'm not going to do more colors. I'm going to start a small set of them in the middle. Because those will go way towards the middle. So I'm just going to do all the colors one more time and they'll crawl towards the middle. Oh, I didn't know you were a Joyce. That's interesting to know. Yeah, I, I can see where the, nick, where the nickname would come from. See, I got called by my first and middle name growing up. They, my middle name is Sue, so everybody called me Dora Sue. Well, my little sister, who is 20 months younger than me, when she first started talking, that was a mouthful for her to say. So she called me Sue Sue, and Sue Sue turned into Susie. And I'm still called Susie to this day by my sisters. It's a little weird when I'm out in public and somebody sees me. Oh. <laughs> oh my God, there is joy everywhere. Yes, yes. Oh, I feel a lot of joy when you guys come in because I love spending 45 minutes to an hour with you guys twice a week. And I love talking to people in the comments. I love talking to people in, in chats on Facebook and in emails I get. And I'm going to be doing um, a couple of uh, private little lessons, too, um, just to help some people with, with this technique. Well, not this one, the cup technique, the one with the, cu the cup bottom pour. Okay, this one's going to be so hard to get it with no dribble, so I'm just going to go real quick. Yes, it's dribbling, but hey, this bottle is... It needs a bib. Okay. Oh, thank you, Joy B. I'm happy that I give you guys joy. I, 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 I love seeing you guys every week. That's what made me do more on my channel with the COVID because I I didn't go anywhere. I wasn't around people, and I am a people person. I got to talk to people, and I don't want to talk to people in this building because all they want to do is talk about their aches and pains or, or their social security or, or you know. <laughs> Kelly Jean, when you were naughty, that's a good one. Okay, let me give it a little bit of turquoise because it's already crawling almost all the way to the middle but I wanted to get all the colors in this little one and then I'm gonna I think I'm gonna do three leaves right here and maybe one right here and no, 
I know I'm going to do three. I might do three and then two. I don't want to do a whole, I don't want to do leaves on every corner. And I got two shades of green um, to do them with. And of course, I'm going to put the, uh, put the, um, where's Brian went, where's Brian when I say, um, uh, put the white in between the two and then use my skewer to kind of, feather it out or pull it out a little bit and I should have a recorded one up this week um, okay that's that for the, that side so now let me see uh, okay I'm going to do three over here this is Olive Green Deep by Amsterdam. And of course, this thing won't stay down. I hate these caps that come on the little tethers. Okay. And then I'm going to do a little bit of white. Oh, hello, Gail. How are you, honey? Nice to see you. white right there and now I'm going to put a lighter green on it that is permanent green light uh, right there right there okay uh, I think I'll do one here, and that's it. I think that's all I'm going to do right here. I'll do a big one. Well, hello, Sam, and hello, Julie. Nice to see you guys. Okay, I'm going to do just one bigger one right here. So I'm just going to make the dot a little bit bigger. And some white. And the light permanent green. Okay. Now is going to come the true test. What's the napkin going to do? Now I can't remember if she did anything with her skewer before or after. So I'll just wait until after. Okay. Got my big linen-like napkin. A whopping 17 by 17 inches and I'm just gonna get it wet to soften it and the fan blows the water back in my face because I got the fan pointed at me okay let's see I guess it's not really going to matter which side I do it on. I'm guesstimating about the middle because everything went wonky on me. Now I'm very, very careful. I see an air bubble over there, but it now disappeared. I don't think the air bubbles really matter. I really don't have to push it down on anything. To tell you the truth, I've uh, got black paint already on my fingers. Well, here comes the moment of truth. Four corners, and you get your fingers in these sides, separate them. Grab the middle of it and bring it up. Come on. 
come on, open up, open up and say, ah, there we go. Okay. Well, that's interesting. I'm going to draw the little tips of these out like leaves. Just to give them that leaf look. I don't know what I did wrong, why these didn't turn out. I'll probably have to go back and look at it. Uh, Gail, it is. <laughs> it is. You just, you get to doing it enough. Thank you, thank you, Rochelle. <laughs> thank you, Joy B. Thank you, Renee. Thank you, Shannon. Oh, hello, Tara. Hi, neighbor. So, let me put some of this down. Let me see if I can maybe drag out well, I doubt that's going to work either. I was thinking maybe I could drag that out a little bit. Okay, let me... I'm just putting back black paint where the napkin picked it up. That's just something that the napkin does but it's something that uh, you can't prevent. So I'm just making sure that I get my little side. Oh, there it is. Ah. I ended up getting the whole thing dipped into the paint. Ah. Black paint. Black paint is like terrible. It just gets it on everything. Okay, let me put this over here so it doesn't get too much more dirty. Let me try not to get the paint, black paint where the color paint is. Let's smooth this out just a little bit. And you guys know what I always say. I'm like a bull in a china shop when it comes trying to smooth out this paint without getting the base paint into the petals. May not be even even, but it will it will settle down. And okay, wipe there. Wipe that side. Yeah. Okay, let me put this under here. Yep, I'm gonna give it just a couple of baby spins just to see what that black paint will do to the flower. Okay, let me spin it real quick the other way. Okay, well, it kind of gave some movement to my leaves. This doesn't help. Okay, let me see what kind of lacing I, I got some really beautiful lacing in this one with the white. Okay, now, because I'm going to end up getting, before I bring it up for a close-up, because let me see what time it is. Yeah, I've got enough time. When I, bought, when I bought the painting, I was told by Brian that we would all get one of these as a gift. What this is, it's a little thing that you can stick to the bottom of your turntable, your spinner, 
and then you stick a stick in here and then you've got a handle that's going to stick out so you don't have to worry about trying to grab underneath um, so this was the little gift I got from him um, I don't know which of my mods has a uh, has a link but there he is Brian you need to put the link to your Etsy shop up so everybody can go order this little spinner right here okay this is double-sided right here so you peel that off you stick it to the bottom of your spinner and it's got a little thing there and a little thing there for you to put a st uh, stick in you know one of the popsicle sticks and then it becomes a handle underneath your spinner which this is the this is the best invention yet next to sliced bread now before I bring that up for a close-up and get paint all over my hands I have to show these off because I'm in love with them Brian I am in love with them look at this look at this the shine on it the color the movement oh Oh, the spinner won't be in the uh, shop till tomorrow. Okay. And aren't you going to have the stands in your shop tomorrow too? That was one painting I bought from him. And I got this one. Ha! I love it. His little, his little itty bitty negative space over there. Okay. Um. Oh, hello Nicole. I just now saw you come in. And I told you last night at Christina's Live that um, I was going to get them today, and I did. So thank you, thank you very much for Brian, for those Brian. Y'all need to go check out his channel, okay? Now, um, I'm going to do, I don't want to take it off of there yet. So what I'm going to do is, is I'm going to grab this by its little spindle and bring it up this way so you can see the lacing I got with that white and these leaves are just so cute I love these three little ones I put over here as you can see the white blowing out a little bit I love the effects I got in the middle and I hope that when Fiona watches this tomorrow, because she's in bed asleep, I hope, um, that she tells me I did good this time. But I love the effects and the lacing. So, for those of you in the United States that haven't tried this yet, oh, thank you, Brian. It's a little wonky, but hey, flowers are not perfect in nature. Um, um, did you get the package for me today, Linda Serrani? Okay, or Sir, Sir, Ron, Sir Ani? <laughs> I'm making, Linda S., how's that? Did you get the package from me today? Um, Thank you guys. Um, so anyway, um, the recipe for it, for those of you who are in the States and don't have access to what she has um, over in uh, her, her European products. Um, um, thank you, Shannon. Thank you, Renee. Thank you, Tara. You guys are awesome. I love that. Um, so anyway, um, my recipe for it's down there. Um, Fiona likes it, likes the pouring medium to, that's, I, cause I sent her the, uh, oh, okay. I'm sorry, Linda. Maybe it'll get there tomorrow. Um, but anyway, um, she, she likes the effects that I get. Sear, E, Ann. Sirianne? Is that right? 
or Siri Annie. Okay. <laughs> oh, I'll get it yet. Hey, hey. You know, um, who's whose name do I whose name do I? Well, I know Tara's last name. I, I can pronounce that one right. Thank you guys for coming out. I hope that everybody learned a little bit, even though I didn't do it perfect, okay? But this is the effects that you get with the Floetrol and the Emulsibond. Although, Tara, don't get the Emulsibond from Menards. I don't know what it is, but that batch from Menards is crappy. <laughs> oh, okay, so it's Sear E. Annie. Okay, I've got it now, I think. So, did you hear that, Brian? Sear E. Annie, okay? Linda Essel, <laughs> cheater. Oh, yeah, of course, of course, of course, yes. And, um, oh, hello, Jola. Nice to see you. Um, there's a couple of places online. I have a link below. Don't let the picture in, the, in, their, in their advertisement fool you. It is the same stuff. It's just a different picture of a bottle. Um, the stuff from Menards needs to be strained three or four different times. I just, I don't like it. So I ended up buying it by the gallon from other places. Oh, I'm glad that you did, Tanya. So anyway, um, everybody, go check out. Um, I know Massey boys are on at 7. And uh, Linda, um, Cheryl has been putting up uh, Joala. Okay. Okay, I, I probably pronounced it right or wrong. Um, that's why that's why I like typing as a moderator in chats because I don't have to worry about mispronouncing people's names just misspelling it. Um, and then Kathleen Osmore Cause Creations goes uh, has a premiere later on. Yeah, um, I'll text you the link to another place I found too that uh, ships to you. Um, so you guys, oh, that's so cool, Brian. You guys have an awesome evening. I hope that you guys are not getting bored with these flowers I'm doing, but I'm just learning so much from Fiona, and I'm practicing, and you guys get to learn with me while I practice. So, uh, hello, Justine. <laughs> okay, so y'all have, yeah, like, like Renee says, y'all have a wonderful evening, and take care, everybody. And... If you're new to the channel, please subscribe. If you're watching the replay, su subscribe button's gonna be right up here. And let me move this over so it doesn't cover it up. There's gonna be a video over here and a video over here for you to check out because I love doing these. And I'll post some other videos up there. Y'all have an awesome evening. I love the fluid arts right out of you guys. And all I can say is, Bye for now.